Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock and with a lack of huge Nintendo announcements for 2020. According to new information, it sure looks as if August and September are going to be some big months for Nintendo. So let's get into all the information for this video because there is a lot to go over. And let's first start off with Venture Beat's very own Jeff Grubb and what he had to say on Twitter last week. As you can see here, this is Jeff Grubb's Summer Game Mess, which is a list of August and September game events that are coming up. And as you can see there, between August 11th and August 22nd of this year, a wild card slot has been placed for a Nintendo presentation. So, according to Jeff Grubb, who I might add is an extremely reliable source, an August 2020 presentation is going down. Now, this ties into what I have to say next because four brand new future maintenance schedules have been revealed by the Nintendo's official website, as you can see here. Starting off on the left hand side, it states this for the Nintendo Switch use of downloadable software for certain network services, and the date and time for this is Wednesday, August 19th, 2020, 7 p.m. to Wednesday, August 19th, 2020, 8 p.m. Pacific time. There's a second maintenance schedule for the Switch, Wii U, and 3DS for the Nintendo eShop, and this is for the use of prepaid funds cards and the use of downloadable codes. The date and time for this is Monday, August 24th, 2020 at 2 p.m. to Monday, August 24th, 2020, 6 p.m. Pacific time. Also, on the bottom left-hand side of your screen, there's a third maintenance schedule for the Switch, Wii U, and 3DS for the Nintendo eShop for the use of prepaid funds cards and the use of downloadable codes. The date and time for this is Monday, August 31st, 2020 at 2 p.m. to Monday, August 31st, 2020, 6 p.m. Pacific time. And the fourth and final maintenance schedule for the Switch, Wii U, and 3DS for the Nintendo eShop for use of prepaid funds cards and the use of downloadable codes is scheduled for Monday, September 14th, 2020 at 2 p.m. to Monday, September 14th, 2020, 6 p.m. Pacific time. Now, with Jeff Grubb stating that a Nintendo wildcard presentation is going down between the dates of August 11th and August 22nd, something is happening because there is a maintenance schedule scheduled between that time frame plus a couple of more right after that and at the moment there's no telling whether this will be a Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase, a used Nintendo Direct or something more between these time frames. But one that sticks out to me the most is the maintenance schedule on September 14th, 2020 because September 13th, 2020 marks the 35th anniversary of Super Mario Brothers, and we all know that with this date coming up, Nintendo will announce or plan something on this date or right after that because September 13th, 2020 actually falls on a Sunday, so it's kind of uncommon to have a Direct on a Sunday, but it's possible that we get an announcement on the 13th and then BAM, we get a major Direct, probably a Mario Direct on the 14th of September. This is most likely when we get our first look at this rumored Mario collection coming to the Nintendo Switch and probably even a surprise Mario game as well. Now, we also have word from prominent leaker Marco Mero on this situation as well, so let's get right into what they had to say. A delay of six months is a lot, even if we count that this game was almost done since 2019 and waiting a good spot since that. The game was moved eternally at least four times, late 2019, spring 2020, summer, and the current date. And this is in reference to Pikmin 3 Deluxe, which Marco Merrill talked about last year in 2019. And here's the original 2019 message. Pikmin 3 will be ready to roll on Switch in April 2020, announcement early next year. This deluxe version will have all DLC included, plus new missions for one player and new multiplayer modes alongside some quality of life improvements from the Wii U version. And of course, Marco Merrill was spot on with this leak back in 2019 because we just got word last week that Pikmin 3 Deluxe is coming to the Nintendo Switch this upcoming October with all these new enhancements. And here's a new message posted by Marco Merrill on August 9th, 2020. About the Mario Switch games, I expect Nintendo to make move before the 20th. September 25th looks like a good day to release something alongside November 13th. And down there at the bottom, someone named Soul asked Marco Merrill before the 20th of August, and Marco Merrill has stated yes, 20th included. So, with all this information coming from Venture Beast Jeff Grubb, along with Marco Merrill, and four back to back to back Nintendo Switch maintenance that have been scheduled, big announcements are planned between August and September for Nintendo. Now, as I stated earlier, there's no telling if these are going to be Nintendo Switch Mini Partner Showcases, General Nintendo Directs, but the September 14th date really stands out. We have to remember that September 13th, 2020 marks the 35th anniversary of Super Mario. So hey, something is going down on that date or right before that date. Nintendo has to announce something because it is the 35th anniversary and they're not just going to go away without saying anything or without announcing something. So. Expect something to happen between August and September, no exact dates at this moment, but 
when something happens, I will come back with other videos. Alright everyone, that's going to do it for this video. What are your thoughts on everything that was stated here? Please let me know down in the comment section below. And if you like this video, make sure to hit that like button because it really does help out the channel and gives exposure to other people who do not know about Around the Clock. Also, please share this video as well. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you don't miss out on new and daily Nintendo news content right here at Around the Clock, where here we focus on Nintendo gaming news around the clock. Catch you guys in the next one.